Uh, this would be um, the grave of Bismarck Key. Uh, if you look up online, it is this cemetery. Um, fairly recent, there has not been um, any grave, um, any marker rather, that has been put up yet. But you know, the workers came by, they're like, oh, you know, you're looking for the famous singer, uh, Bismarck Key. I'm like, yeah great dude great music and they're like that he is buried uh, right over here that there is no marker um, for him yet uh, this is in Pine Lawn uh, Cemetery uh, if you look online you could actually uh, match this up uh, through find a grave uh, where you see that this uh, pretty much uh, is the same um, a location uh, if you do your your investigation discovery but I did confirm that this is um, the unmarked grave they're putting up a headstone I would imagine soon Let's see this is uh, grave 67 plot L range 50 plot 2 section 80 and if you want to do some some journalism, you look at it uh, right around this neck of the wood here, right near this little um, sidewalk next to a monument grave, uh, sidewalk uh, monument over there, straight up ahead. And you see the shrubbery on the picture. Uh, the shrubbery is right there. Uh, so, uh, the grave of uh, Bismarck Key. And Bismarck Key, uh, you know, hit song, Just a Friend. Um, a moderate success on the R&B uh, singles, uh, Make the Music With Your Mouth, Vapors, but just a friend that made him a star, uh, reaching number one on the Billboard Hot 100, achieving platinum status. Video was an MTV hit, song was later ranked among VH1's 100 greatest songs of hip-hop. Crown Prince of Hip Hop, the Clown Prince. Now, it wasn't meant as a knock. It was meant on him being a extremely uh, artist that has extremely funny music and persona. Later singles, uh, later singles were popular with rap audiences, but didn't really cross over to mainstream radio play. Um, you know, you had What Comes Around Goes Around, Young Girl Blues. Uh, he also made his guest stars on other songs. Uh, Beastie Boys, he starred on their songs as well. Will Smith toured with Chris Rock. Just a friend, though. Really, how can you not? When you're at the club, all of a sudden the DJ drops. Just a friend. Bam. The whole club would just uh, uh, pop. And, um, you know, it's not even... Uh, you don't even have to like rap music, per se. It's just a song that kind of uh, crossed over and resonated with a lot of audiences. Um, also uh, good in uh, acting. Um, appearances in Living Color, Men in Black.
So Marky on enduring popularity of just a friend, what he said, that's what I go into the studio to do. Create me music that people will love forever. I always knew that record would be big. And that's from a 2013 interview. Uh, the cemetery here, um, if you're looking at it, you drive all the way in the back, uh, section 80 again, all the way, all the way, all the way, all the way in the back from when you come into the entrance. Uh, hopefully by the next time you guys do visit, uh, you would be able to uh, see something here. Um, I expected the plaque, I was driving by and I expected uh, the plaque to be here, but... Um, it was not yet. Um, a star that tra just transcended. Um, died really young too. And the song, what made it so popular too, is the is the is the hook. And, and the fact that it just, you know, kept it, um, kept it simple. Didn't try to play anything controversial. Um, and it was just a song, you know, that everyone sees. That sings along to. The DJ could stop playing the, the song and boom, there you go. Just a really, a really um, popular song. That's okay, uh, once again. Um, the unmarked grave, as of now, for Bismarcky. True legend, the true pioneer. Uh, would be right over here next to uh, Mr. Uh, McAdams.